y'all. <laughs> How y'all doing? Hope you're doing well, looking well, feeling well. If you hear the air in the back, oh, I'm so sorry, but it's hot, okay? Um, so it just needs to be on. Love y'all though. Um, either way, y'all, it is officially August. Happy August, y'all. Um, I think I'm probably about the only teacher right now smiling that it's August. Um, because I think everyone else is dreading this month. But it is well. I'm excited because I am officially going into my old classroom today and I am moving my stuff to my new office and if you don't know what I'm talking about if you missed the last video I'm gonna link it up right above here so you can know why I'm moving rooms but I'm excited y'all so um the goal of today is for me to go in and just remove all of like my stuff like my personal items that I purchased and get them like moved or at least like boxed up and put in a work order for maintenance to move to my new office um yeah I really like really 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 wanted to get this done prior to like my principal sending the welcome back email you know we all dread that email but I wanted to like get in there and move it before because the person that they hired to replace me is obviously going to be trying to get into her classroom soon as possible, right? Probably the first day she receives the email. And so I was like, mm, let me move my stuff before she think that I'm just like trying to hoard and I'm not. It's really just the stuff that I bought personally. And so I'm like, let me just move my stuff. Or even some of the stuff is like some things that like some subscribers had like purchased for me before, which thank you guys so much. Um, so either way, I wanted to like, put the new things or the old things in my new office so that's what i'm doing today all right you guys we have officially made it to the building one thing i love about summer you can park right outside the door <laughs> you don't have to actually park in a parking spot no one actually cares um oh gosh this is so freaking good oh look my classroom door is open well i guess it's my old classroom now they did put my desk back. Oh, and they brought over everything. Oh, so cute. Oh. OMG. This looks so different. Like, let me just give y'all a quick pan of what's going on. Y'all, here is the building. It looks so strange in here. Like, just the way things are set up, it looks strange. Like, I don't know, I can't even fathom. All right, you guys, so, I quickly disperse some things, trying to figure out what goes with what and what I'm gonna just let go to the trash or whatever. So in this top drawer, I had like options so like the kids know like what they wanted for lunch that day. They can make the choice. So I left that in there. I had a bag of like dice that I use for games, some old stickers and some sticky clips. So I just left those in there because I know I don't need them. This is a bunch of paper. And then these are these are called um, Mighty Minutes, which we use with Creative Curriculum. So those are also in there. And I'm actually gonna put this in the right order. I don't know why this is randomly out of order. Um, I'm gonna leave these in here now. To be honest, is this a container that I bought? Yes, but do I care to keep it? No, it's fine, you can have it. <laughs> Bags, I also left, like there's tape in here, binder clips. I always, this is like my number one tip if you are a pre-K teacher or a teacher that's just now teaching kids to write, get them golf pencils. I, I always will ask like my parents for golf pencils for the kids and I have so many left over. So I just left those for her. Again, she can use them if she wants to. If not, that's her prerogative. I don't personally need them. Welcome to the closet. <laughs> Y'all, it is nuts in here. It's dark in here. One of the lights is like out. I don't know if you guys can see how dark it is back there, but literally, 
when the lights is out. And I feel like the crazy part about it is this is always the light that we always have to ask for them to replace. Like, I don't know if they're just using the cheap lights or what. But either way, welcome to the closet. Um, I have a closet mate. So we actually share a closet between the two classrooms. Or I used to. I'm still trying to get used to it. I used to have a closet mate. So um, one side of the closet is hers. The other side of the closet is mine. And y'all, it's a lot of stuff in here. I'm not even going to hold y'all up. The amount of stuff in here is actually quite ridiculous. And I feel like... I don't even know where to start to like start to pack my stuff up. But one thing I know I'm officially going to have to do is put up another box. So let me go get some tape. Let me go get that box and let's get this thing going. I need the space to get into this closet right here. And yeah. Yo, I am sweating, you guys. Like, it is hot as Hades in here. <laughs> Woo. Hot. Okay. Hot. All right. Let's go on a quick. Oh, let me give you guys a quick tour before I leave here. Hold on. All right, you guys. So, this is the front door. Let me give you guys some lighting so you can see. And if I sound out of breath, it's because I am. Um. Anyway, I'm going to give open it up. We have some curriculum stuff and some statewide stuff. There is a desk back here, which is one of my teammates. This is all of her boxes. Y'all see all of this? She gonna have to get rid of some stuff because I don't know what that is. But her desk is back there. Um, this is usually like the common area for when staff come in for um, common planning. So if they need to prep, whatever, we kind of typically leave that stuff there. Um, we have like back supplies, a lot of this stuff, even these boxes over here is a lot of stuff for the teachers, but the person who deals with curriculum stuff has to come in and get all this stuff out and she needs to get this to those people. So here is that with stat. Some of her stuff is over here. This is all her desk stuff. And yeah, it's not a big room, you guys, but that's the quick little tour. And honestly, I don't know how they're going to get me in this room, too. Like, I don't know where I'm going to go. There ain't no room. I wouldn't mind, like, being in this cut right over here. If they can somehow run a wire for me to be there, I'd be okay with that, actually. Because I feel like I kind of have, like, my, my own little nook. So, let's hope if they can do that. If I had any requests, if they would honor any requests, I'm going to see if I can kind of get in that back little corner um, because I'm okay with that little space. I'm going to have to see how that works out. And that's it. All right, you guys, we are officially done moving offices. This is crazy. Um, I'm excited to get some new things done. I ran into a few people who I work with and they were all like, congratulations on your position. So I'm excited. This is different. I'm definitely used to setting up a classroom <clears throat> and the fact that I'm not, I'm like, what is this? But um, it'll be well. Mm -hmm.